Hello everyone, it's uh, Joel from the Chronological Channel, I'm back for another video again. And today we're going to check out this indie horror game called um, Genophobia. I picked it up the other day and uh, I'd never heard of it before. Um, but I did a little test and from what I gather it's it's a bit more of a shooter horror, you know, like um, Left 4 Dead or that kind of game where you, there's going to be kind of hordes of enemies after us. I think from the screenshots I looked at anyway. So without further ado, let's give it a shot. Um, quick look at my options. Everything's on max pretty much. We sync. Um, Alright, sounds okay. Yeah, I did a little test, um, but I only played like five minutes just to see if everything uh, works. Whoa, this feels weird. Feels like one of them 3D videos you can get. Just because of how like, zoomed in it is. Uh, some panties. I don't think they're ours. Then again, I don't know what gender we are. For male or female. What is that? A sponge. Foggy. Gives off a bit of a. Silent Hill vibe, that. Uh, that's, um, is it E? Genophobia is an abnormal fear of women. Never even heard of that. Um, picture of a woman and a little boy. That could be us, and that could be our mother. Linda Black. Blackthorn Chemical Engineer. Yeah, so there's a women's underwear. So this must be our mother's room. But why are we here? Let's take a look outside. Some boots. There's a peephole. Your footsteps, then. I oh, know, spider. Dude, calm down. It's just a, just a spider. He's actually quite a big one. So he don't like spiders. It's got an abnormal fear of women. Um, that is not good. In the globe. Yeah. <laughs> Shadows Peak. I can hear cars. So. Yeah, you can hear. I can faintly hear footsteps. Dead Hunger. Some sort of game. Ah, so this is our room, I, I suppose. Seems like we can't get in there because that spider's in the way. Ah, uh, what's this? Ah, so we've got a gun now. So it's like we're in the game. A game, game within a game kind of thing. Uh, the graphics are alright. For an indie anyway. Nothing incredible, but got a kind of style to it and the atmosphere's kicking in now it is a bit eerie oh no I can hear things can we run oh yeah yeah so pretty uh, basic control shifts run and I think click is shoot Gonna be enemies here. Oh, this is pretty freaky. Can I crouch? 
wonder if I can sneak past. It's kind of weird how it moves when you're crouched. It kind of like takes one step at a time, kind of thing. Um, okay. I feel like something's going to jump out at me. Can't do anything with this machinery. Where does the game want us to go? Don't know. Oh no, they're coming. Coming after me now. Uh, they, they do go down quite quick if you get headshots. So I'll try and do that. Headshot! He went down in one. Duh. Yeah, it does remind you of... Uh, well, what the hell? It is a bit, um, a bit left for dead. That for an old uh, zombie game. Back in the day, I think. I never actually played it, but I remember, I remember it. Oh, no. There's loads of them. Um... Not really sure if you meant to uh, actually kill them or just run away. So I'm going to be running out of ammo soon. There's a different room. Picked up some health. Laptop there. Yeah, they're not very scary, the actual enemies, actually. Yeah, so you've got to kind of keep moving on this, and you can avoid them quite easily. Can we jump? Oh yeah, we can jump across them gaps. That's quite good. I'm not blooming sure where to go, guys. Um. Oh wait a minute. Are we back? Alright, so I'm out of ammo. Oh, we've got a knife. That'll have to do for now, because... Uh... That arm's stuck. Yeah, it's a game where you've got to dash around, really. Um, and just... Don't get hit. <laughs> ah, I got some more bullets. Nice. Where the heck do I go? Is this where? Is this where we started? <laughs> he can jump over the top of him. That's quite cool. I might have to edit some parts. Um, ow! If it takes me forever to find where to go. See though. So let's just think where we ain't gone. It's a little bit down here. Now, who's that guy? That's that door with the machinery in. Um, well, my hand twitched then for some reason. health. Can we get in that door? Why? It looks like... No, there's no prompt to get in it. Is that health? 
there's plenty of supplies, so we're not really in trouble. Ah, this is. Uh, <laughs> yeah, pretty easy to get rid of enemies, really. Um, oh, wait, that's a different bit. Can I get around the other side of them bars? Oh, you can go through them. That is a massive gap, though, isn't it? Health is full, that's good. Ah, oh, there's a ladder. Let's get them support. What the hell was that? What the hell? Where, where did you come from? Weirdo. So enemies can swim. Alright, so we've, we've actually got quite a lot of ammo now, so that's good. This must be where you go. Uh, game progress saved. Ah, we're outside. I need to find wheels for that van. Now this looks quite good, uh, guys. Just keep it an eye on my time there. What the hell? So I'll uh, keep these at about 30 minutes. Um, I might have to do a part 2 of this. Oh, what? Oh, no. <laughs> Let's try that again. See, it actually uh, saved. Yeah, I need to be quick on this. Let's get onto the streets. Yeah, the game itself is actually quite fun. And the... Um, Atmosphere is kind of cool. It sort of has that. It does have an indie feel to it, but there's something kind of charming about it. What the heck? That's a. Was that a wheel I could pick up? We can avoid that big guy because he's not really doing that. Oh, what? I need to carry it. Where's the van now? What's that? Is it an helicopter? Yeah, it's like an old army copter. Come on. I need a toolbox. So we're trying to get this van going to escape, I guess. There's a lot of space on this level, though. We can actually evade the enemies. Toolbox, alright. Keep your eyes peeled, folks. Down. Oh no. They are quick, you've got to be careful. If you're trying to get in a corner or something. You've got to be really quick. Now screw that up. Your health does go down really quick. Yeah, it's a sort of dashing game. Like where you've got to you got to pick stuff up. What's that? Yeah, there wasn't really anything down there, so that was kind of pointless. Oh, <laughs> that were in breathing. Thought there were monster behind me. Dead bodies on the street. Uh, music's quite cool. So we got the time. Where the heck is this toolbox? That's not a toolbox. Some sort of purse. Ooh, machine gun. Oh. No. Get away. Oh no, 3% health. I 
think I'm dead. I got some. Oh, so you get about 50% for them uh, packages. Uh, you can't get in this shop, can you? Oh, that's. Whoa. Damn it! <laughs> so we know where it is now. So we have to do that again, but at least we do know where the stuff is. So the car. Yeah, it's all. Um, I wonder if we have to find anything else after this. Can we actually go around this way? Come on. I wonder how the fear of women comes into it then. Because we're just fighting kind of monsters, aren't we? None of them look female yet. Maybe one or two of them. I need to go outside at um, shopping centre. Ah, now screw that up. So if I can, where was that machine gun? It's mouth. You've got to just make sure they don't pin you up against the wall. That's when it all goes wrong. Alright, now I've lured him round, I can uh, nip in here quick. I am actually enjoying this game quite a bit though, it's quite fun. Oh, what the hell? Why did he? Why did he drop it? What now? I'm confused. What? It didn't say what to do, did it? Ah, oh, the machine gun. Pitch hard. Headshot. Ah, oh, do we need... Ah, uh, there's more wheels. That makes sense, because I thought... I thought it only had, like, one wheel, didn't it? That's not going to work. Get out of my way! Wheel there. Uh, need a tool... Was that not actually a toolbox? What <laughs> I picked up? I'm confused. Alright folks, I think I'll end this one here. It's it's gonna take a little bit this level. It's quite challenging. A lot more challenging than the first one. So we'll give it another go on the uh, second part. <laughs>